Princess Snow White. Once upon a time, in a small kingdom, there lived a kind and gentle young girl named Snow White. She had long flowing black hair, fair skin and a heart as pure as gold. However, her life was far from perfect as she lived with her weak stepmother, the queen, who treated her like a servant. Every day, Snow White would stand to the gardens of the castle, singing sweet melodies to the birds and animals that would surround her. One day, as she sang her heart out, a handsome young prince named Otto happened to be passing by and was enchanted by her beautiful voice. He approached her and they talked for hours, instantly becoming the best of friends. As days turned into weeks, Snow White and Prince Otto grew closer and closer, sneaking secret meetings in the gardens whenever they could. However, the Queen soon caught wind of their budding friendship and grew jealous of the bond they shared. Determined to get rid of Snow White once and for all, she ordered her henchmen to take her deep into the forest and leave her there to perish. Alone and afraid, Snow White wandered through the dark and dangerous forest, hoping to find shelter before nightfall. Just as she was about to give up hope, she stumbled upon a cottage with seven tiny beds. Curious, she entered and was greeted by seven friendly dwarfs who welcomed her with open arms. The dwarfs, whose names were Happy, Grumpy, Sleepy, Sneezy, Dobby, Bashful, and Dog, Snow White as their own and promised to protect her from the Queen's evil glasses. In return, Snow White cooked, cleaned, and sang for them, bringing joy and laughter into their humble home. Meanwhile, back at the castle, the Queen was not pleased to hear that Snow White had found refuge with the dwarfs determined to get rid of her once and for all, she disguised herself as an old hag and ventured into the forest with a poisoned apple in hand. One day, while the dwarfs were out walking in the mines, the queen approached Snow White with the apple and offered it to her as a token of peace. Not suspecting any foul play, Snow White took a bite and fell into a deep sleep, unaware of the danger that loomed over her. When the dwarfs returned and found Snow White unconscious, they were heartbroken and feared that they had lost their dear friend forever. Just then, Prince Otto arrived at the cottage. Having learned of Snow White's disappearance and set out to find her. Seeing Snow White lying lifeless on the bed, the prince was filled with sorrow and leaned down to kiss her forehead. And in that moment, Snow White opened her eyes and awoke from her excited slumber much to the joy and the relief of everyone present. With the evil queen defeated, Snow White safe and sound, Prince Otto and Snow White declared their love for one another and were married in a grand ceremony. They lived happily ever after, surrounded by their loyal animal friends, the seven dwarfs, and a kingdom that celebrated their love and kindness. And so, the story of Snow White and Prince Otto became a timeless tale of love, friendship.
friendship and a triumph of good over evil, inspired generations to come with its message of hope and happiness.